We finally got to do this apartment tour video. As we're moving out. <laughs> Literally days before we're moving out of this apartment. my apartment let's go this is the entrance into our place and this is a long hallway it's quite a walk this long hallway is a little weird but it's been really good for us we use half the hallway for storage so we store some of our stuff like luggage and bags and then down here the second half of this hallway is the shoe hallway and so we got quite a lot of shoes down here we got like four big shoe racks here Alicia's up in the front I got a few back there. We got some casual shoes, got some dress shoes. These are more like my everyday shoes, styling options. Here's where we have our hat collection. We wanted to use this hallway space a little bit better. And this is the spot where we keep our keys so we don't lose them. And in these bins here we have our winter stuff, scarves, gloves, and also it's where we keep all our socks. And you made it. Welcome to the living room. Our favorite stuff in this room, uh, we got the two shoe walls there. On this side of the wall, I have all my dress shoes. So we got designer shoes like Gucci, Saint Laurent. Mix of like my favorite designer dress shoes. A lot of favorites on this wall. I can't tell you all of it in this one video, but these are definitely one of my favorite, the Saint Laurent. I wore these a lot, definitely my go-to. I just got these guys recently. These are the Tom Brown with the strap. I really love this. Finally got them on sale. That was awesome. Okay, two more quick ones. I really love these Tom Ford loafers. I wore these in Paris, love this. And these are the Gucci Chelsea boots. The wall, I have like a mix of designers and Jordans. So I have like designers on one side and then I have common projects and I'll have Jordans and Nikes on different shelves. For designer shoes, I really love my Gucci sneakers. I got these last year for Christmas. And then I also got these Balenciaga. These are definitely two of my go-to designer shoes. And then for the sneakerhead out there, uh, I gotta say I love my off-white Nikes, the off-white Jordan, and the off-white Nike Blazers. Of course, you can't go wrong with the classics. You got the Black Cement 3s, and you got the Concord 11s that just came out. And this is my favorite prize possession. This year I got the Yamaha Digital Piano. This is the 143B and it's my favorite thing I own ever in my whole life. Hey Alicia, are you gonna play us something? Well, if you insist. This clothing rack number one in this apartment this is the main rack that I leave in the living room. This is when I plan outfits, so I put a lot of stuff that I plan to shoot. So you can see right now, it's a lot of winter coats, a lot of holiday stuff, because this is what we're shooting a lot this month. Another jacket, denim jacket, my spring stuff, they're all in this closet back here. I love this part of the room. This is the massage chair, especially after like traveling. Oh, sure, it's nice. So, this is our very nice couch. This is where we do most of our relaxing. Um, and I really love this coffee table because it does this. So this is actually where we eat dinner and watch Netflix. We have movie nights. We got this lamp. And now we're gonna go into our office. Let's go. This is part of the office, kind of like a showroom. This is clothing rack number two. And this is like a big double rack here. I have all my suit jackets, blazers up top, and then I have my dress shirts at the bottom. Uh, unfortunately, it got a little too heavy at the bottom, so it's a little slanted. Over in this corner, I have my sunglasses. I have accessories like pocket square, my cologne, and pins and stuff like that. And then also we have our bar cart. Over in this corner on the other side, uh, Alicia doesn't like this corner. No. Uh, I have my chair, so this is kind of like where I throw all my stuff, these are the chairs. But I also have like my sweaters, my jeans, and bags. On this corner of the office, we have another dresser. 
all my camera equipment basically up here. I have the cameras up top, the lenses over here, and framed as my GQ in the GQ magazine back in September 2015. <laughs> this is where we usually sit at the office. This is our work desk. So I've got my laptop, my phone. We do most of our work out of this space. So I sit right over here with all my stuff and then right across from me. Oh, hello. This is my seat, which is the best because it's right next to our espresso machine. And we also have a drawer here for miscellaneous like electronics and our equipment and um, notebooks, which is very important to me. Office stuff. Office stuff. These are my babies. I've never kept anything alive except for these guys since the beginning of the year. And they're very, very precious to me. So this is our bedroom, which is basically my room. I won't let Leo have anything in here because he has stuff all over the apartment. Um, and I really like minimalist things, more minimal than Leo, so um, everything in here is white, basically. On this side I have all of my skincare stuff, and then over here, my perfumes, and then some of my books. And I have, in this bookshelf, I have my purses, and this is kind of like my get ready workstation. On this side of the room I have another dresser and some more books and then I have over here a little closet. This is my side of the bed so I have some more books on the nightstand and then this one cuts to the bathroom. Well, that's the bathroom and then we have a little uh, storage situation in the hallway keeping our bathroom stuff, towels. There's the kitchen, it's not that nice at all. This is like one of the older near city apartments that you'll see. So it's definitely not modern. I do most of the cooking, Alicia does the dishwashing. And then on this side, we got like coffee and preparing food, toasters, uh, fruits, and then we have like recycling. And it's kind of messy. Kind of like a typical fridge. Uh, we collected a lot of magnets in our early years traveling. It's been amazing living in this apartment for the past two years. Yeah. Uh, I think we've definitely grown a lot. Mm -hmm. uh, Levitate style has grown a lot. This move is a little bittersweet because we've actually been in Astoria for about five years now. So we've been in Astoria, Queens, and now we're moving to a totally different neighborhood. Yeah, we're gonna move to Dumbo in Brooklyn. It's definitely one of my favorite, favorite spots mm -hmm. in the city. Um, it's just so beautiful to take photos there. Quick thing about New York City apartments, for you guys thinking about apartments in New York City, mm -hmm. this apartment is about 900 square feet and it is about $2,000. It's an older building, but we got so much space out of this apartment, mm -hmm. which we definitely needed for all our stuff. Mm -hmm. I know like Astoria and Queens, people don't hear about it that much, but it's part of New York City. It was amazing getting close to Midtown. So it's actually really accessible, really great neighborhood. Great food, great cafes, and they have the Astoria Park nearby, which is really beautiful. Yeah, so all in all, it's a really great area, really good price for the rent, mm -hmm. but we're just looking for something more of an upgrade that we need in our lives. So can't wait to show you guys the new place. This is gonna be so nice. Really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you have any comments, questions, what's your favorite part of our home the past two years, and can't wait to show you guys our new place. Um, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you guys for watching. Thanks.